Hey guys, this is Sophia and this is what's going on on News for Us today. Police are still searching for the shooter out in Bruce and we found out that he is not only a convicted felon but he is also armed and dangerous. So again, if you do see him or happen to know about his whereabouts, please, please, please call your local authorities. Students at EMCC, new students rather, are going to have to go through orientation and it is mandatory. So don't think that you can slip out on it guys. And here is further proof that humanity has hope. Okay, so kids you people who are worried about you know possibly not having any summer jobs you know getting a little bit extra cash because of the you know budget cuts suffered by MDOT well an anonymous donor has donated $35,000 just to help out young teens being able to get work this summer so again that's amazing it's a great story we'll have more tonight on WCBI news and of course the full story will be posted on our website at WCBI.com and if you're an Elvis fan be ready to be all shook up this week because it's gonna be all Elvis all the time from concerts contests to reenactments so if you want to look forward to a good time be sure to head to Tupelo for the Elvis festival and if you didn't know today is National Donut Day and here's a fun fact did you know that the term donut actually came from the fact that they used to put nuts in the dough of the bread before they cooked it and served it to people and that's what's going on on News Press today. Be sure to check out all these stories and more on our website at WCBI.com. Tweet at me, comment on our Facebook page, and as always, this is Sophia signing off, and I will see you next time on News for Us.